next guest has become a huge internet sensation. She's also a best-selling author and the star of the children's show Tab Time. Take a look. Can I tell you something that's been on my mind? I can? Very good. You know, I've been doing a lot of thinking about how things grow. You see, most things start out really, really small. And then over time, they get bigger. Are you trying to make bigger mud? Is that why you're watering dirt? <laughs> no, Ivy. I'm watering the dirt because I just planted some fruits and vegetables here. And the water helps them get big and strong. And then later, I have a lot of delicious food to eat. Oh, I love eating. It's my second favorite thing to do after shaking my pit. Shake my pit. <laughs> Please welcome Tabitha Brown. It's fantastic. Well, very good. You look great. It's good to see you. Thank you. So you did something for us for Ellen Tube. So thank you I so much did. for that. I had so much fun. It was like a dream come true for me. Well, it, yeah. it was great for us. We we thank loved having you. you. And you're very popular for posting things on social media. How did that? But it, this is this is an interesting story. Tell everybody how that came about. Well, I first started. Uh, first of all, I never wanted to do videos. And let's let's be honest, okay? I was an actress. You know, I moved here to pursue acting, and I was always told if you do videos, honey, they kind of frown upon that and nobody took you serious and so I tried to always stay away from it but when I had gotten sick and uh, I had like what I call my last uh, final call to Jesus in the bathroom I had a meeting in the bathroom with him I was like Lord if you heal me you can have me and later I had a dream and saw myself on like a, a show but the screen was real small and I was like okay as you know as, as a kid always my dreams have always meant things to me so I woke up and I was like okay what, what was that you know reveal that to me Lord and I heard a voice that said, start doing videos. And I was like, yeah, no, I don't want to do that. And so he was like, remember you said, if I heal you, I can have you. I said, ooh, you caught me on a bad day that day. But I did, <laughs> I did say that, you know. And so I was like, all right, well, what am I going to do videos about? And so I used to do stand-up trying to get a TV show out here in Hollywood. And so I first started uh, doing, uh, you know, the same thing I would do on stage, talk about being a mom and being a wife and telling stories. I was a sit-down comedian because I was still sitting on my bed and things. And so <laughs> after I became vegan, after a 30-day challenge, I was like, okay, I'm going to be vegan now. And I heard a voice that said, now tell people what you're eating. And I was like, oh, Lord. You... I had also shaved off all my hair. And I'm from North Carolina, a very small you know, town. I was like, Lord, I'm going to get on here and tell people I'm... I done shaved off all my hair and ain't eating meat no more. They're going to think I done lost my mind out here in Hollywood. Uh -huh. You know, but I did. And so I just... Started doing, a, you know, videos and tell people, you know what? I'm going on a journey and I'm going to show y'all when I find food that I like and, you know, new vegan options. And I did. And it was about 30 people watching. And I was like, okay, Lord, what do you have me doing? <laughs> and the next thing you know, uh, about four months in, I was driving Uber and did a video sitting in my car, which was a, a TTLA sandwich from Whole Foods. I was like, ooh, this thing good. I need to tell the people I found a new vegan option. And I went on back to driving Uber after I posted the video, and I got home and turned my phone on, and I had all these, like, views, like 50,000 views. I was like, oh, Lord, who watching this video? And then the next morning, I told my husband, I got, like, 100,000 views on this. I think I'm going viral. He was like, what'd that mean? I said, I, I don't know. <laughs> and so <laughs> uh, four days later, Whole Foods reached out, and they were like, oh, we saw your video. We love you. We would love to work with you. And I became their brand ambassador, and I ain't drove Uber since, Jesus. Thank you. Mm -hmm. And um, it started taking off from there. Wow. Yeah. And now people call you America's mom. So how does that sound to you? Ain't that something? Uh-huh. You know what's crazy? I had, you know, when The Secret came out and everybody started doing vision boards, I did a vision board years ago. And every year I would put, I want to be known as America's mom. Because I want really? to Really? I always, wow. always. Only because I wanted to be like Claire Huxtable. Okay? I wanted a TV show where, I, you know, because that's who, to, when I was growing up, she was like America's mom to me. Right. So I wanted that type of thing. I didn't know the real just me being me was going give me that title. And people just started calling me that. And I was like, oh, my Lord, that board thing be working. Yeah, it does. Yeah. That board it, thing does work. Yeah, that board be yeah. working. Yeah. 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 I truly believe in manifesting uh, your life. I, oh, I, I believe that, that, you know, words are powerful, thoughts are powerful, and it's energy, and it's all about our energy. So good yeah. for you. You've, you're actually, you know, proof of that. So tab time. Tell everybody about that. Oh, uh, so tab time is uh, near and dear to my heart. It's a children's show. 
And a couple of years ago, in prayer every morning, I, I'm always asking, like, what am I supposed to be here for? And I kept hearing the words, heal the world. And I was like, I'm one person. I can't heal the world, you know? And I would hear it every day. And then when I was sick and finally healed myself through how I was eating, I figured, oh, my body is my world. And so I healed my world. But I kept hearing it every day, heal the world. And so in prayer one day, I heard a voice that said, it starts with children. And I was like, oh, I should do a children's show. And then if I can get children to open their minds and see themselves as they are and know that they're okay, however they are, and to see each other, despite our differences, to love each other, to give compassion to each other, then those same children will grow up one day and be adults who love each other, who see each other, who will be willing to help heal each other, and then the world will be healed. And so, that was it. <laughs> um, but that, that was my idea. And so when I got with my new team a couple of years ago, I told them, I was like, I, I have this idea, I want to do a children's show. I want to bring back, you know, Mr. Rogers type feel to right. television. Yeah. Um, as a whole black woman with an afro, okay? that just be on adventures every day with uh, children and with animated characters. And I did. And so now I have tap time and I have special guests that come and we uh, go on an adventure. We have a question every day that I, think about in my garden. Mm -hmm. And so the whole episode in every episode is about answering that question. That's and it's, it's a great way for kids to learn without them knowing that they're learning. Yeah, no, it's great. It's a yeah. great idea and it's, it's amazing. Tab Time has new episodes every Wednesday on YouTube Kids and we're gonna play a game after this. We'll be right back. All right. This winter, we must all five four nine nine nine. Feeling it's. I worry. Bus and freeze. Hot covered laundry. With Ellen's friend Courtney. Tabitha Brown, and we were just talking about how great Goldie gummies are. They are a convenient and delicious way to incorporate essential vitamins and nutrients into your daily health routine. Right, Tabitha? Absolutely, Ellen. So the ingredients in their four flavor gummies, the products, they have many health benefits, they taste amazing, and they also contain no artificial sweetness or flavors, and they're all gluten-free and vegan. Do you have a personal favorite? Ooh, I do, honey. <laughs> Ashra is my favorite. It's like the goal is Ashra gummies. They're made with ashwagandha. They help me relax, restore, unwind, get a better sleep so I can be my best. They do a little something else, but we're going to talk about it. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You, you you're going to find yourself in a redwood tree. <laughs> Let's put yeah. your best to the test to demonstrate who the health benefits. We are going to play a little game called Goalie Ball. All right. All right. Here's how it works. Popping up behind that wall will be large goalie gummy bottles. Tabitha and I will have 60 seconds to throw these oversized gummies at targets. Don't eat these, Tabitha. These aren't real. Oh, these not okay. No, no, they're not. They were good. All right. Uh, there's one moving target that's worth double the points. If together we knock down 25 targets, then y'all are going to get a prize. Let's get 60 seconds on the clock. Okay. All right. Let's go.
know how I lost works. track of how many points we got, but we all want you to try Goalie Gummies, so you're all going to get a $150 Amazon gift card. Yeah. <laughs>